What's up, you cockamaniacs? Well, I don't think I had to tell you why am I here. Oh yeah, finally we got Star Wars Battle freaking front after, oh my god, I don't know how many years, but they skipped a generation. I don't know what took them so long. That's like a no-brainer, man. Freaking Star Wars. And, well, as you can see, I'm excited again. And um, I don't want to get to talk about too much into the game because there's actually uh, a couple of things that I don't like. But, uh, like always, I'm getting way ahead of myself. And uh, let's open this, shall we? I can't believe I'm actually doing this. I've been waiting for this so freaking long. Oh my God, I don't want to mess this up. It is heavy. Got it? Oh, damn it, come on. Come on, come on. Please don't fall. Oh. Okay. Okay, here we are. Okay, I think this is the side. I don't want to mess up. Here we have the beautiful PS4 controller. Oh, would you look at that. I don't know, what do you call like the square thingy? I'm so old school. I mean, that's supposed to be the start button. But well, the square thingy, the touchpad, if you will, uh, you can see that it says Star Wars and it's not a sticker like the the craft, the craft, the cra craftsmanship. The craftsmanship, no, I'm getting fancy now. Uh, I mean, you have to touch it to feel it. That's what she said. Also, like the paint job, uh, it has like a chrome feeling and it looks, it looks pretty nice. Actually, they really stepped up their game with this controller. The other thing that I like is that the circle button, you know, for the Western audiences, uh, for the most part, it's cancel, and it's like red, like, oh my god, don't press circle. So, yeah, actually, the, the arrows are red too. Uh, R1, it's blue, I don't know, that doesn't make any sense. Why? Because, because Jedi juice is blue. And uh, we have L1 and red, and uh, that's pretty cool. I mean, not too gimmicky, the, the R and L buttons. I'm loving it so far. See, we have the regular uh, headsets and uh, HDMI cables. You don't care about that. Okay, here it comes. The big one. Here it comes. And uh, okay, okay, wait a minute. Let me, I got this. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> now, here we have the game. Uh, I'm glad that it's a physical game because sometimes they bring like the, you know, the voucher for the digital, digital copy and I hate that because, you know, I'm a collector and stuff. Let's open this bad boy. Get it. I didn't notice, but this is the deluxe edition. So I'm guessing, I'm guessing it has to include the season pass. I hope so, let's find out. Well, guess what? It doesn't include the season pass. It promotes the season pass. And really, so I bought a freaking new PlayStation 4 and it doesn't include season pass, but it does include some DLC. And we have like a blaster, a DL-44, an ion grenade, an ion torpedo, oh, thanks a lot, an ion shock emote, and a victory emote, yay! And uh, it also has the Battle of Yaku. That's at least we got a, a, a map. Well, I don't know if it's a campaign because it just says the Battle of Yaku. So it might be a map. Because, I mean, if you don't know, if the first time you're hearing about this game, First of all, you're living under a rock. The game doesn't include a campaign. And I have no idea what were they thinking with this. It's like, 
It's like freaking obvious. It's a no freaking brainer. But oh well. No, I'm not gonna say to each his own. You must do a campaign. And please read the fine print. You cannot use this content until uh, starting December 8th. So now you know and knowing is half the battle. I know I always say this, but I'm a retro guy and I'm an old fart to each his own, but I love these. This voucher includes four classic games. It includes Star Wars Jedi Starfighter, Star Wars Bounty Hunter, Star Wars Racer Revenge, and last but not least, Super Star Wars. Oh yeah! That 2D action platformer from the Super Nintendo days. Did you ever dream we were gonna play this on the PS friggin' 4? Let me try not to kill the the Galactic Empire army that I have in front of me. Okay, here we have, we're going to the meat and potatoes of this. There you have it. What's up, Anakin? <laughs> There you have it, the Star Wars Battlefront PS4 limited special of your ass edition. And we have the poster boy, Darth Vader. Were you expecting to see Luke Skywalker? I don't think so. And uh, okay, now here's the thing. It's okay. I mean, I wasn't expecting like, oh my God, the mega art. But I seriously, like you could get this custom made and really, it's not very special. I don't know if it's me, and if you guys have it, you can post it in the comments to see if we agree on this one, but the paint job, if you will, it feels like you, you could scratch it with your nail and it will come off. And not like every part of the paint job, like for example, uh, where Darth Vader breathes, it feels like that. It's hard to explain if you're not actually touching it. Touching it. Uh, what you see is what you get. Now, there's a redeeming quality of this PlayStation 4 console uh, in the art department. What I do like, even more so than the regular Darth Vader um, artwork, is that uh, as you move the PlayStation, it depends on the lighting and the angle, you can see like, you know, Star Wars logo, it's all over the place behind Darth Vader. And uh, it shines and it looks pretty nice. Actually, that looks like it has good quality. If you don't own a PS4, I mean, it is a good place to start because you get Battlefront. You get the PlayStation 4 controller, which is cool, and you get this custom paint Darth Vader PS4. I mean, it could be worse, it could be a regular PS4. But like I said, if you're like a purist collector and you want to get like all versions of the PS4 because you're just nuts, like a certain someone, I would say uh, don't get it. And as always, I want to thank each and every last one of you for watching this video. If you're not a Carcomaniac or part of the Forger of Pains family, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe and... Join me. Together, we can rule the galaxy. Creo que no trae el Season Pass. Vale verga, chucha madre. Te compras el fucking PlayStation y no trae el Season Pass. Ok, no te van a cabrear, pero bueno, ni modo. Got a dog, baby, I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she's anything but calm. A regular pint size, I had a bomb. I had a bomb, baby, I had a bomb. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want her to be. 
a million times hotter than TNT. Bum, 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 bum,